This is a CRZY special report concerning the bizarre phenomenon occurring in Murgatroyd. Good evening, viewers, citizens of Murgatroyd. As most of you by now know, something very strange has been happening in Murgatroyd over the course of the past few weeks, and it has both medical experts as well as researchers baffled. It began with what researchers and analysts are calling Case Zero and it was a young woman who was a delivery person to the Vincini Cosmetics Corporation. The young woman was discovered in an alley with two puncture wounds to her throat, she was cold, unconscious, paramedics declared her dead, but prior to an autopsy in the medical examiner's office, the young woman woke up for lack of a better term. The other phrase that has been put forward is the term spontaneous resurrection now that it has happened three different times. We sought out Dr. Derrickson for his observations on this strange phenomenon and then he had this to say to us here at CRZ. Yes, 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 uh, thank you very much, uh, you may listen. Uh, well, I, as you know, I have not had the, the good fortune to be present when any of the, the three victims of this phenomenon were, were brought in. Uh, you talk about the, the first woman, the, the case zero. And I know that she was not directly affiliated with the Bencini Cosmetic Corporation, but that she apparently was a, was a cosmetics delivery person who went there frequently several times a month, as a matter of fact. The other two individuals were both males and, and were the same scenario. You know, they were discovered in different parts of the city, of bite marks in the neck, apparently dead at least unconscious, they're brought into the morgue, um, declared clinically dead, and then they spontaneously resurrected. Uh, the only only theory, the operating theory that, that I would put forward without having further details, and there's a lack of data at this moment, and everyone's baffled, is this must be some sort of a, either a viral type thing or, or perhaps some sort of a disease which would mimics death and that perhaps in, in fact the three individuals weren't actually dead, they were simply in a comatose state. That that would be the, my initial observation. Again, further data would be required before uh, you know, I could offer any educated guesses or speculation. That this at this stage is simply too early. And of course I hope there are no further cases, but three of them so far and, and we do not know the whereabouts of the three individuals uh, who uh spontaneously resurrected after they left the uh, medical examiner's office. They walked right out of the coroner's office, of course, much to the shock and consternation of the person there. And uh, the law enforcement has been unsuccessful in locating these three individuals. So, so thank you again for, for having me here at CRZY Humility Center. Greatly appreciate it.